here we have um, a person that has taken a heavy drug uh, mm, that has a lot of atropine. He actually had taken Datura. I've uh, shown that example also already in the other manual. Uh, so we pick up this uh, frequency up here. Uh, so maybe we should get closer so we can actually drag the cursor over the area and let the cursor go and we will zoom into it. Maybe we can zoom into more. We'd like to see what what's happening with uh, this frequency and the harmonics. You have here um, the first cursor and now uh, we have it checked in the circle and then we check it to have the harmonics. And we see that this harmonic is perfectly from that fundamental. This peak also is perfect from that fundamental but we would like to see which, what does this peak here in the harmonic signature. So uh, let's um, take this off for a moment and let's get another cursor in and try to find uh, that which that uh, which is that one so we click on that 26 and we put those harmonics in the cursor and the harmonics in and we see that this really got that peak so we zoom in and we see that this yeah that peak belongs from that fundamental which is 126.36 we uh, just Clicking on the right mouse, mouse button, it will get back to what we had before. Now we can see both harmonic lines. We click on the center to that cursor, and there we have both harmonic lines. And we can check into this peak and see how they become. And then we see the first one is more exact. Uh, so now we can zoom back. And we would like to see what that frequency is in the database. So we um, click this and we go into the database. But I remember it had to do with the uh, master frequency. So here we go into master frequency. And uh, we locate the anticholinergic, which is belongs to the drug that was taken and we select the fact and here it is uh, atropine this is what the compound that was most in this uh, the datura that this person had taken so this master frequency has telling us about it instead of molecular weight in this case so now we look at the other frequency and uh, what it did in the mo in the mm, NS database, and it seems that the person has arthritis, and that one belongs to uric acid. This uh, person seems to mm, get better relationships with master frequency than molecular weight. But here we have that this peak belonging to. Uh, this other cursor, sorry, that cursor uh, makes the really that peak here more than the other one that belongs to the uh, a sudden peak that appeared in the harmonic signature. Now we have here another case that we would like to see why these peaks have appeared suddenly. So let's zoom in to get close to those peaks and we click here and we actually set the FFT better so we have here sev uh, 176 as the highest frequency here and if we click on the nutritional database we will see this person has problems with the immune system that it belongs to vitamin C which actually this person was taking vitamin C for a while so then we want to see the harmonics and we see that that peak here is belongs to a harmonic of the vitamin C as you see it's perfect there but we don't know what this one is about so we 
we did click with the right uh, mouse button and we go back we set it so the right so then we're going to go into this other this here is another harmonic here so we pick that one and uh, well we should have done it with the same let's leave that one and we have to do it with a second cursor to pick up this this new one and there we see in the nutritional database we click to go to the nutritional database and again with uh, immune system we click on tyroxine T4 appears here and this is something else that this person is taking so let's see what how it appears and uh, let's put both harmonics together and let's get close to this section so we see here that both of them make this peak exactly vitamin C and tyroxine T4 are creating this peak in the center of the uh, wave of FFT but tyroxine 4 is making this one meanwhile vitamin C is not we click back and uh, now we can see that uh, we can use several buttons for harmonics and uh, this is the curve this one is makes the the circle makes the 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 cursor active the cursor has to be checked up here and this one creates the harmonic lines so here we we check two harmonic lines to understand these two peaks that appeared suddenly in the FFT wave